Hey, what's up? This is Anthony with AGT Exotics, and today we got a Scolopendra species mint leg China. Very awesome tea, or I said tea, very awesome centipede, uh, rare to the hobby. Hey, what's up? We're about to house our Scolopendra species mint leg I just got. This is a birthday present to myself. All right, we got this enclosure all set up. It's bioactive. I have uh, a bioactive substrate in there. I got a nice piece of sheet moss, one solid piece, and some uh, baby's tears here in the corner. Hopefully that will bush out here and grow. And these are some uh, magnolia leaves. Alright, let's get this guy out of here. <laughs> I think I'll let it do its own thing, and I will just pick up the container when it leaves its container. Alright. Whew! There we go. Beautiful specimen. Oh my gosh. Wow. That reddish brown contrasting with those green mint legs is intense. Beautiful. Alright, I'm going to get this lid back on here. I'm not trusting it. Wow, what an intense little species. Beautiful. Sorry for the reflection in the lamp right here, but I can't take any chances with this thing. There we go. Beautiful. Try to get some photographs, I believe, before it goes away. <laughs> and I don't see it for the next couple months because it hides. It looks like it just got back one of its back little uh, sensors from a molt. One smaller and looks clear. Oh, very cool. I'm going to try to get some closer footage. It's cleaning its, uh, I don't know what to call them. I don't know what their front parts are called. But. Scolopendra species mint leg. Freaking awesome. What a beautiful creature. Wow, 
Wow, this is by far the coolest creature I got here. Wow. I have my tripod and my iPhone inside my enclosure here and it's the legs of this tripod are maybe three inches from this dude so at any moment it decides to bolt up this I'm pretty much screwed so hopefully it stays focused on this do we Such an amazing critter. Those mint legs. Such an awesome contrast to that brownish red body. Um, I have the camera kind of zoomed in kind of tight right now, but uh, the dubia that's in the back legs tried to move and it grabbed it <laughs> with the legs that are near it. So I don't know if it's aware that it has two um, predatums at the same time right now. crunching sounds. Amazing. That's into a hard dubious shell. 